working with disabled people and coming together as one group. We've all been like helping each other with different movements and different positions and trusting each other and it was just like a great experience. People standing on wheelchairs, um, crashing down, standing on bags, um, splits. We've been asked to um, help out with this um, integrated dance project. We've just been doing warm-ups and putting most of what we could create together into one piece. The kids at Berkfield High really connected with the wheelchair children. They really got attached to the disabled children. They really connected with them and then they just loved each other. I joined this because I really wanted to open myself up to like more things and I thought that just getting to know how to to communicate with them would be just a good life skill I guess. We did basic games and then through those games we found our moves and we paired up with people I don't even know from school but now I get to, got to know them. Dancing with disabled people, it was I just had to. I just had to like get out of my own way because it's like they don't have a problem. It's kind of like I had the problem, like the awkwardness maybe. But then you just I like let go, and then you just get to know them, and it was really cool. What we're doing is um, a dance on being heard, we want to be heard and what we're basically doing is trying to get a dance, so our dance is like harsh, like, like you're not being heard, you want to be heard, you're screaming, you shouting, so all our moves are like bam, 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 because we want to be heard, we're frustrated and you understand the feeling of not being heard. We've been doing the splits and uh, turning and uh, everything we did. I like, yeah, I like each one of them. I hope I like me too, and I hope I can turn to the school again. This project particularly special was that um, this is I think the third or the fourth time that we've been with Bergfleet High School so there's already a culture of um, understanding what we do and understanding what this project is about. Um, the other thing that was special was that we had a tremendously large number of kids sign up which was wonderful um, and we took I think 25 of them from, from Bergfleet. You'll see on the, in the performance that some of the Bergfleet High School learners have a chance to experience what a wheelchair is like and that's actually because we didn't have a strong ratio. We had, a, a sh a, we had fewer Kaylee dancers than we had Bergfleet participants. And I think that is something that's really unique and special to the project, is the opportunity to really experience what somebody else is going through. Even if you can't get the full experience, you get a little bit closer than your everyday life experience. So you'll notice um, in the performance, some of the big strong boys have a moment in the chair. They have a chance to wheel themselves around and feel what that must be like. I think the participants got on incredibly well. When I came in, I noticed they already had a rapport between them. They already had clear material, which I could choreograph on. Um, they knew what they were doing, and they also knew the ethos of the project. So this idea of integration and this idea of connecting to someone who's maybe a little bit different than yourself. Working together, doing the rock and bird, it's uh, where uh, an able-bodied person is with a disabled-bodied person and we do shapes and pose in those shapes, which is quite interesting. I know that a lot of people can get confused and judge before they actually experience it. That is why I actually came to this uh, workshop in order to free myself from questions and also judgment. We were asked 
to do this in assembly and I was kind of, I didn't really know if I should do it or not because like also we have to like stand up and do it in front of the whole school. It's great interacting with him, it's hard at first, but you get, you get used to it, you get into it and although we didn't have a, like um we only had two weeks to do this, it's been, oh, it's been a lot of fun. exciting and I love this performance and it's very beautiful.